Technology. In this video we will show you the basic controls for the AD, H265 series DVRs. The start button all the way to the bottom left of the screen allows you to access the settings, log in, log out and shut down the DVR. The full screen button to the right of the start button allows you to enter full screen mode. To exit full screen mode move the cursor all the way to the bottom of the screen and press the exit full screen button in the same location. The next button switches the DVR to single camera view, and three following buttons switch the DVR to four camera view, nine camera view, and sixteen camera view respectively. Because we are using an 8-channel DVR you can see that after camera 8 the rest only have a plus sign. The plus sign indicates that an IP camera can be added to that channel. In this case this DVR supports 8 cameras by direct connection but 4 additional cameras can be added via IP. The other split modes button allows you to arrange your cameras in different ways to suit your needs. Be aware that aside from having different split modes you can also click and drag any camera view to a different position at any time to rearrange the cameras as you like. The OSD button is used to toggle the view for on-screen display such as the camera title and icons shown inside each camera channel. The playback button is used to view recorded videos, search for events, and backup videos to external media. The manually record button forces the DVR to record everything regardless of the current recording settings. The green dot on the top right of the camera view signifies that recording is on, it will go back to yellow to signify motion recording when the manually record button is toggled off. The manual alarm button is used to trigger alarms manually, we will cover this feature in more details on another video. The record status button displays frames per second, bit rate, stream type and quality for active recordings. The alarm status button displays the status and details for events such alarm in, alarm out and motion detection. The disk status button displays information about the disks on the DVR. The network status displays information about the network such as connectivity, open ports and etc. We will go more in depth into the status buttons on more advanced videos. The information button displays general information about the system such as device name, model and firmware version. Here you can also find the QR code for the unit to add the device to a mobile client. Apart from the DVR control menu, cameras also have their own control menu which will pop up when you click on the particular camera. The first button from left to right is used to turn on manually record. This button does the same as the main manually record button but only activates recording on the selected camera instead of the whole system. Similarly the instant playback button plays back video recording for the selected camera instead of all the cameras. The enabled audio button will allow you to hear audio for the selected camera if the camera has a microphone. The snapshot button takes a screenshot of the selected camera. The PTZ control button allows you to move and zoom the camera if the camera is motorized. This button also allows you to enter the camera's OSD menu if the camera is UTC compatible. The zoom in button is used for digital zoom. Note that this is not the same as an optical zoom on motorized cameras. Digital zoom simply enlarges the camera view to allow you to take a closer look. Finally, the image adjust button allows you to change settings such as brightness, contrast, saturation and hue. It also has lens controls which allow you to adjust the optical zoom and the focus on motorized cameras. This covers all the basic controls for the DVR, we will go into more advanced controls in other videos. This video is brought to you by Shield Technology. Feel free to leave comments and suggestions for future videos. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel and visit shieldcctv.com for updated information on Shield Technology products.